Greetings Internet, I am Ken from the Computer Clan and I want to show you today some of the new features in the Windows 10 Creators Update. We're going to start with some changes to Microsoft Edge. Microsoft Edge now allows you to set tabs aside for later sessions, and you can even bulk restore them with just a click. You also have an option to view previews of the tabs in little thumbnails on the top. Tabs can also be closed from this interface. Microsoft Edge now functions as an e-reader. You can download books from the Windows Store, or you can open up EPUB files right from your computer. This menu lets you change the font and the theme of the book. The computer can also read the book to you, and you could bookmark pages for later. The Windows Defender Security Center is an all-in-one application that will allow you to scan for viruses, check your computer's health, and perform other security-related operations. All of the troubleshooters for the system are now located inside of the Windows Settings application. Paint 3D takes the classic Paint application to the next level. It will allow you to work with 3D objects and work with stickers or textures on those objects, and a lot more. Remix 3D is also a place where you can share your own 3D models and get 3D models from other users. The dynamic lock feature will allow you to pair your own phone with your PC. When you walk away from your computer, the system will lock. Games can now be live broadcasted from Windows to the Beam platform. Game mode will help your computer prioritize your game processes to help them run smoother and give you the best experience. While this will help you out with Win32 games such as Portal 2, more performance enhancements will be noticeable with apps from the Windows Store, also known as Universal Apps. Nightlight will reduce the blue light in your computer screen. This is ideal for lower light environments as the screen is typically easier on the eyes with a warmer tinge. And the last feature I want to share with you today is that you can now group Start Menu tiles into folders. Now the point of these types of videos, which we call tour style videos, is to give you the information in a quick, short and sweet presentation. If you would like more in-depth information about this update, check out our Tidbytes demo. So there you have it, a quick tour of Windows 10 Creators Update.